At a height of 256 feet, the Arts Tower at the University of Sheffield is one of the tallest academic buildings in the UK. The tower opened in 1965 and currently holds the title of the second tallest building in Sheffield. As you would expect, the building contains two conventional lifts, but why take a regular lift when you can travel in this, a Paternoster lift? This design of lift features separate cars in a chain, constantly moving along a vertical belt. With no doors and no stopping, passengers are required to step on and off the lift whilst in motion. This particular example is reported to be the largest of any Paternoster system in Europe, featuring 38 two-person cars serving the building's 22 storeys. This allows for up to 76 people to be transported at the same time, far more than any conventional lift can achieve. The continuous motion, however, means this design of lift isn't suitable for those in wheelchairs or with limited mobility, and for the movement of large or heavy objects. Only a small handful of these lifts still survive in the UK, with many having been decommissioned or demolished in recent decades. The University of Sheffield, however, has continued to maintain and preserve this unique piece of engineering, with a major overhaul given to the system in 2009 during the tower's refurbishment, bringing the Paternoster up to 21st century standards. As the cars are on a continuous loop, the chain curves around at the top and bottom, allowing for the change of direction. We chose not to ride this section, but we let our camera go for a ride around the loop instead. 